Happy Wednesday, folks. September 20th, 11.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Here's your market update in 90 seconds or less. Mortgage bonds and stocks both started higher today. Mortgage-backed securities right now are up 21 basis points, so that's good news. Obviously, the big story for the day is going to be the Fed meeting and the Jerome Powell press conference right around 2 o'clock Eastern Standard Time today. Most financial analysts, like we've been saying the last two, three weeks, believe that the Feds will pause the day and not do a right right hike. 71% of these same analysts believe that when they come back and meet in November, they'll do another pause. But that may not be the case. It will all depend on where CPI is at, inflation, where the job numbers are at. They're going to take a look at a lot of different factors when they meet in November if they're going to do another rate hike. But obviously, let's wait to see what they do today because the Fed always has something up their sleeve and can pull a surprise on us and do a rate hike. But let's, let's hope and expect for a pause. Real quick, let's go over mortgage app data that was released by the NBA. It showed mortgage applications for purchases rising 2% last week or they rose 2% last week. They're down 26% year over year. Refinances jumped up 13% last week. They are down 30% year over year. But a 13% jump in applications for refis last week is a big jump. You're going to see that number keep rising as folks try to solve their credit card issues with the equity in their house and you know, also have depleted their savings. So you're going to see that refinance number keep jumping up as we move along throughout the rest of this year. That's all I got for you today. As always, I'll keep you updated. If you're looking to buy, sell, refi, give me a shout. The Davis Mortgage Team, the Moore Mortgage Group. I'm the Loan Cowboy. Catch you next time.